Uh, this one is uh, called My Ode to Abraham Valt, who is my favorite statistician. Um, so it's kind of about maths. You'll like that. Okay, my old tavern vault. Three depressed guys walked into a pub and one brave member of staff asked, What? Is this a joke? But nobody would laugh. But this is not about them, you see. Flashback to America, circa 1943, see? The designers of planes in World War II faced a mathematical challenge. Planes had to be light enough to fly, but armored enough for damage. So, the military officers analyzed those planes that had come back and computed for themselves some general statistical facts about the average level of damage each section of the plane took, as in, the fuselage had 1.77 bullet holes per square foot, or the fuel systems had 1.33 bullet holes in them, although the engines had next to no hits in them and so we'll just add more armour to the pieces that are taking hits and we'll compute exactly how much with the help of a mathematician. So enter Abraham Valt and the question this poem is about, but back to those three depressed guys in the pub who were thinking out loud, what's the worst thing about depression? What's the worst thing about depression? The first one said, well, I have to take these drugs called SSRIs and they've left me this considerably larger size, the weight gain is a bit shit. The second one balked, angrily retorting, Are you kidding me? Sometimes I can't get out of bed in the morning. Oh, and I hate it when people offer me condescending advice. Like, I always feel great when I do yoga during a sunrise. <laughs> the third one halted them and proclaimed, I know. The worst thing is that it kills your libido. And they all went silent and nodded in agreement, but this, like I said, is not about them, see? Abraham Vault solved his plane problem by recommending that much more armor be put on the engine. But why? the military officer asked. That sounds insane. When most of the damage we have is on a different part of the plane? He said, imagine planes under attack, with every single spot have an equal probability of taking a shot. The reason you don't have hits to your engines is that you don't have data on those planes that don't come back. See, taking bullets to your engine means that your journey will soon be ending, but back to those street press guys in the pub, but this poem is still not about. As they went to pay for the drinks before they went out, the bartender asked them, have you ever heard of Abraham Vault? All three of them stopped and ground to a halt. The bartender asked them to show him their wrists, and all three of them did, though they were puzzled by this, and like the engines on those planes, they were unmarked by hits, there was not a single mark upon any of their wrists. See, this is not about them. So if you want to know what the worst part of depression is, look at the ones we've lost. More specifically, look at their wrists. Thank you.